Good evening. Hi, sir. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Nice, nice. Pretty nice. How are you? Good, good. Thanks. How was your day? I was really busy. Uh-huh. Yeah, that was really busy. All right. Where do you work, Gustavo? I'm, I'm a teacher. I'm also a teacher in a private school, yeah. Oh, okay. What do you teach? Uh, actually, I have different subjects, including uh -huh. English, right? Okay. Yeah. Oh, well, that's good. So you're teaching online right now? Correct. I'm teaching online. Here right. at Zoom also. Excuse me? Here, using Zoom also. Oh, okay. <clears throat> good, good. All right. So yeah. welcome back, everybody. Um, do you guys remember what we did yesterday? The topics we covered yesterday. Somebody, anybody? I was not in the I'm sorry. Simple task. Okay, simple past, yes. What did we say about the simple past? Yes, Roxana. Hi. Yes, so there we practice about the pronunciation of simple past. About also about the ed pronunciation, okay. regular and regular verbs, and also all right. Yes. Uh, how many sounds do we have in ed? Three. Three. Three is correct. Can you pronounce those three sounds? Um, Anybody? Yeah. Oh. Anybody, whoever wants to give it a try. Yes, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Okay. Good night, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Oh, good evening. <laughs> it's good a call. Time. It's okay, don't worry. Don't worry, be happy, teacher. <laughs> exactly. We are here to improve, to learn. Okay, thank you very much, teacher. Sure. So who remembers the three sounds that we have for ED? Uh, become. What is it? Become, became. Okay, but the no. three sounds of ED, like if I say, what is the past tense of clean? What is the past tense of fix? And what is the past tense of cooperate? Uh -huh. Similar play of the... Uh, T and D. Okay, T and D. When yes. do you pronounce the T sound? <laughs> when the verbs is a voiceless or it finish with uh, J, K, M, L? Okay, yes, when the sound is voiceless or when the termination of the sound doesn't have any vibration, then the ED sounds like t and that's why you say fixed, word. You say t when do you pronounce the d sound? Cleaned, played, stayed. When do you pronounce that sound? Somebody, anybody? When, when the word uh, finish in ed, like a uh, played, lived, or rained. Okay. It sounds it like a d. Okay, it sounds like D. So when do you pronounce the D sound with the ED? In which scenario do you use the D sound? 
regular. Yes, we're talking about regular verbs. But when exactly do you produce the D sound? T. Stay D. D as in Thomas. No, D as in David. D as in David, okay. According to the table, uh, it's in the second part, very ends in voiced. V, G, V as in Victor, Z, C, H, T, H, J, etc. Okay. All of them will sound like D. Okay, so Played, lied, lived, and reigned. Okay. What's the example? All right, good. Yes, so ED will sound like uh, D. You will pretend that... ¿Qué pasa? That letter E... D or D? You will pretend that letter E does not exist and you will produce only the D sound. Now, what about sound number three? When do you pronounce Ed exactly the same way you write it? Verse N in D or T, like started. Right. If the termination is D or T, then you will pronounce ED exactly the same way you write it. You will say wanted, needed, started, cooperated, investigated, and so on. Do you have any questions about the ED sound? Yes, I am. I have. How, how do you say? I am or I have? Uh, it depends on what you will use. Well, uh, um, the only way to remember these forms is to memorize them. Uh, not memorize them, but use them. So whenever you're using uh, something in the simple past tense and you're using regulars, just make sure that you remember what we discussed yesterday and what we're reviewing right now. So when you speak in past, you put it into practice. Okay. Yes, any other questions related with ED sound? No? Do you have any questions related to yesterday's class? Not in this moment. Thank you. All right. All right. So, all right, good. So let's, uh, we had one exercise that we were not able to finish. And that's the one that I will show you here. Um, do you see the image? Yes. Okay. Yes. What's the past tense of meat? Met. 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 Go. Met. When. Met. When. Met. Drive. Drove. 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 Sleep. 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 Think. Thought. 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 Ride. Thought. Road. 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 Come. Came. 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 Fly. Flu. Flu. Be. Was where. Was was where. Okay. Okay. Remember, be careful. It's not where. Where means donde. In the past tense of be, it's was and were. Was, were. Was, were. How do you say, donde estaba usted? Where are you? Where are you? No, donde estaba usted? Where were you? 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 Okay, where were you? Where were you? Where were you? Say, you do not say, where were you? You repeat in the same word. So you say, where were you? 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 Okay, so remember, where is donde? War is the past tense of be. So what is the past tense of be? Was and was were. Was were. Was, was were. Sing. Sang. Sang. Collect. Collected. Collected. Very good. Paint. Painted. Painted. Invent. 
Invented. 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 Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Stopped. Stopped. Yeah. ED Stop. sounds Stop. like a T. Stopped. 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 Okay. Stopped. What about hug? Hug. 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 Jumped. 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 Okay, so remember, when we're talking about irregulars, usually, not always, but usually the verb changes. So the past tense of fight is fought. And the past tense of cry? Cried. 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 Okay, good. So, do you have any questions about... Uh, Meaning or pronunciation of these verbs in past tense? A question. No, teacher. All right. Uh, part teacher, two. Can, yes, ask can, me. Can, can you repeat think? Yes, think. To. Think? Oh. The past tense of oh. think is oh. thought. Oh. Thought. Oh. Think, thought. Yes, but sing, cantar. Cante. Sing, yeah, sing, sing. Sing, sing, sing. 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 Write the same. No, sing. you change sing. I for A. Mm -hmm. But it sounds like E. So sing. the past tense of sing is stang. Sing. 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 Yes, sing. 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 So, 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 so how was the party? Sang. Oh, everybody sang, we danced, we ate, and, and, and so on. If the information is positive, the form of the verb has to be in simple past form. Any other questions related with meaning or pronunciation? Any question? No? All right, so exercise right. two, you were supposed to classify if the verbs were regular or irregular. So what is mean, regular or irregular? Irregular. Go. Irregular. 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 Drive. Irregular. 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 Think. Irregular. Ride. Irregular. Irregular. Come. Irregular. Irregular. Fly. Irregular. 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 Sing. Irregular. Irregular. Collect. Regular. Regular. Paint. Regular. Regular. Invent. Regular. Stop. Regular. 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 Hug. Regular. Regular. Jump. Regular. See? Irregular. Regular. Regular. Irregular. Become. Irregular. Irregular. Fight. Irregular. And cry. Regular. 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 Very good. Okay, now we go to part three. We have to some sentence to negative or sometimes into the question form. So letter A has to be changed to the negative form. So Anne played tennis yesterday. What would be the negative sentence? Anne didn't play tennis yesterday. Aha, uh -huh. didn't play. Remember, when the information is negative, you use auxiliary didn't if it's an action and the form of the verb stays Base for basic. Okay, what about number yes. two? Your friends, yes, somebody has a question. 
Teacher, sorry, but I can't hear you because the, the sound of the, the microphone of the old people. Oh, okay, hold on. Okay, ahorita so, que... Maybe, can you repeat, please, sure. the first sure. sentence? Sure. Uh, in part three, we're supposed to change the sentences to negative, sometimes into the question form. And like I was saying, uh, in letter A, it says, Anne played tennis yesterday. The negative form, you're supposed to say, Anne didn't play tennis yesterday. So when the information is negative, you use didn't, and the form of the verb stays base form. Is that clear? Clear. All right. So I need a yeah. volunteer to, yeah. to do letter B. Your friends ate some hamburgers last night. So how do you make that into a question? Can I? Did yes, you, please. Did you, did your friends eat some hamburgers last night? Very good. What about letter C? Alex and Chris were in Rio in October. What would be the negative form? Somebody. Alex, Alex and Chris were not, were not in Rio in October. Good. Letter D, another volunteer. Just a question, Francisco. Yes, ask it me. Is correct if I, uh, it is correct if I say Alex and Chris weren't in no. Rio in October. Sure, it's okay. The only thing is, um, grammatically speaking, people recommend um, not to make any contractions when you are writing. When you're speaking, you okay. can perfectly say, Alex and Chris weren't in Rio in October. Yes, you can. But just remember that if you're, if you're writing, it's better if you don't do it. Okay. okay. Yes. Thanks. All right, good. And letter D, Bettina read a whole book yesterday. How do you make that into a question? Bettina didn't read, read a whole, whole book, book yesterday. yesterday. Okay. Ah, no, it's, it's a question. Okay. It's a question. Yeah, it's a question. Did Bettina read a whole book yesterday? Good. Did Bettina read a whole book yesterday? Very good. Now we go to part four, complete the sentences with the past of the verbs. Letter A, I didn't. Make. Make. Uh -huh. I didn't make coffee didn't today. Make. What about letter B? My friend uh -huh. Steve. I spent the uh -huh. at home. Spent. Good. Letter C. Wallace. Gave. Exactly. Gave. Uh -huh. What about person. letter D? What about literal D? By this. Bout. 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 Did uh, the, did the, the student students bought the ticket no. for the show? No, no, okay. no. Okay. Did the, did okay. the students yeah. buy? The, buy. Okay, did remember. The buy the ticket. It's regular. All right, okay. remember, uh, it doesn't matter if you are using regulars or irregulars. If you're making a question, you did have to do? use auxiliary did. And when you okay. use auxiliary did, the form of the verb stays base form. Do the student. Okay. So, okay. The, yeah. the students buy the, the tickets the ticket for, for the show. show. All right, good. Nice. All right, any questions? Teacher, you can repeat the last sentence, please. Yes. Did the students buy the tickets the for students? the show? Did the okay, students. Thank you. Sure. Any other questions here? Any questions? No questions. No questions at all. All right. Let me see in this here. No, it's not good. Let me try again. I'm trying to take a picture of this. Well, apparently this one is better. Yes, it is. So I'm going to send it to the WhatsApp chat. And 
there you have it. Well, apparently it's going, it's going up Los Chorros right now. Did you receive it? Yes, I have. Yes. All right. So I'm going to put you uh, to work in, group, in pairs. Uh, let's see, more breakout rooms, 23. So we'll have 9, 10, 11, right there. So you guys are gonna be working in pairs and practice the image that I just sent you. Here we go. Oh my God. Saida and Gustavo. Hi. Are you guys ready? Hi. I guess. All right, good. So start working. If you want. Okay. Can you can you talk to me what a kind of class or what is uh, what you talk about? What the one thing I don't know. Okay. Okay. He he said that we have to we have to work in pair. Yeah, or we have to do it. Yeah, uh, the document uh, that is in in, in WhatsApp. And the group. No. Uh, yeah, yeah. The, in the, the WhatsApp the, the chat. Image. Yeah, in the, the WhatsApp, WhatsApp chat. chat. Did you receive it, Emmanuel? Yeah, yeah, I received it. Okay, good. Did you receive it, Jennifer? Yeah, teacher. Uh, right now, I'm I'm looking for all right for the good. document. All right, good. Uh, did you receive? Did you uh, send a document? Yeah, yeah and WhatsApp the, chat. Yes. I saw uh, just an image. Yeah, that that's an it. Image. Yeah, it's an image with blanks. We have to fill it, right? Yes, you have to choose the best answer for each space. All oh, right, right. Just gone, and so we... And we are arrived uh, with a stop that take us to bar, but when we I arrive, there the bus has just gone and so we took Joanna and Margarita are you guys okay no I don't have the exercise okay uh, are you in the whatsapp chat Joanna right now yes okay I send it to the whatsapp chat let me send but, it again. Please. Sure. I can see it. You cannot see it? No. Um, do you have my phone number? Yes, seven nine eight eight six two six one. Okay, send me a message and I'll send it to you there. Okay. I send it. Okay. Okay, did you receive it? Yes. All right, yes. good. Thank you. All right, sure, no problem. Okay, thank you.
ครับอืมอืมเดมิเนอร์เดอะเวย์เดอะแท็กซี่โน่ไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่ไม่ก็ไปที่สถานีรถไฟฟ้าก็ไปที่สถานีรถไฟฟ้าก็ไปที่สถานีรถไฟฟ้าก็ไปที่สถานีรถไฟฟ้าก็ไปที่สถานีรถไฟฟ้าก็ไปที่สถานีรถไฟฟ้าก็ไปที่สถานีรถไฟฟ้าก็ไปที่สถานีรถไฟฟ้าก็ไปคอชยัสเซอร์เอ่อวิ่งหาวิ่งหาวอะอะดับต์ยัสอาสเอเอ่อวิ่งวิ่งหาวอะเบียมอร์เอ่อทิ้งแล้วบัตเอ่ว่งคอนฟิวส์เอ่อสองคำและวิ่งวิ่งสองคำที่คุณคอนฟิวส์ทีแรกเอ่อล่าสุด Last weekend was very funny. First, uh -huh. I called I called my friends to go to the shopping, and then we <laughs> we arrived to the bus stop to take uh -huh. the bus. Right. But, but when we uh, that word we we didn't know what what is. Okay, but when we went there, the bad has just gone. What? Oh, okay. Went. When we went. When? when? Uh, yeah. Okay. The bus has just gone. Ah, okay. And so we took a taxi. Right. Or we, uh, we took a taxi. So we took a taxi. In the right. In the middle. In the middle of the way, the taxi. We went. Uh -huh. Taxi crossed down. Um. Uh, actually, it's broke down. Break. Ah, uh, okay. That. Broke okay. down. That that was the mistake. Yeah, broke down. So breakdown okay. is when 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 the when the car is giving you problems and it's not working properly. Uh, okay. Again, again. Uh, when What? the when the when the car is giving you problems, you're supposed to say breakdown. Ah, okay, okay. okay. Yes. Okay. That was uh, that was the pro the 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 mistake. Oh, okay. The taxi. Okay. Broke down. Oh, and we decide uh -huh. to and go walking. Decide to decided. Walk. Decided. Okay. Yes. Decided. Decided to go walking. After about 20 minutes, we. I don't remember. Um, yeah. We. We saw. We saw the shopping. Maybe. Uh, we no. went again. No. Okay. Uh, car, taxi broke down, and we to go walking. After about 20 yes. minutes, we yes. shopping. We arrived. We what? Arrived. But we, but we used arrived when when we. We arrived. We arrived to the bus stop. Okay, we the saw bus. the shopping. Uh, okay, no. we saw the shopping. Yeah, and we saw the we, shopping. We crossed. Uh huh. And when we crossed the street, we we saw. We noticed. We, we noticed. Ah, noticed. Ah, esa no la usamos, es cierto. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we noticed. It had do, you do you remember the meaning of notice? Uh, notar. Yes, notar. When you see something. Yes. All right, good. Yeah. Let me bring everybody back into the main okay. session. Did everybody have the chance to finish the last exercise? 
Not at all. No. <laughs> okay. That was, no. That was kind of confused. All right. So uh, now that you have the image, that's going to be a uh, part of your homework. You know, when you have the chance, when you have the time, finish it and use the right uh, word in each gap. Cool. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, so that's going to be your homework for tomorrow. Um, any questions about what you need to do? No. No? At the moment, no. All right. So remember, everybody has my phone number. Um, so just in case you have questions about it, you send me a, a, a message. Thank you. All right. Thank so let's, you, let's go with the next um, exercise. <clears throat> All right, here we need ask to you a change. Question? Sure, please. Um, I'm sorry, but I I didn't um access to the meeting yesterday, so can I have your name? Francisco. Francisco. Marroquin. And okay. And your phone number is, is in WhatsApp, I guess, right? Yes, but it's seven nine double eight. Okay. Six two six one. Okay. Thank yes. you. Yes. All right, good. Anybody else has any other questions? No? All right. Can you see the document that I'm sharing now? Can you see the document? No, no. yet. No, not yet, teacher. Okay, hold on. No give yet. Me, give me a no second. Yet, no yet. Share no. screen. No yet. Share. Share. Can you see it now? Uh, yes. Yes. All right. So positives, negatives, and questions. Let me take a picture of it. So everybody has access to it. You see this here? Yes. So I'm going to send it right now. And um, you guys are going to be working in pairs with this one here. Some of them are negative. Some of them are questions. Some of them are positives. So what you need to do is change it to the simple past tense. So remember, when the information is negative, you're supposed to say didn't, if it's an action, or you're supposed to say wasn't or weren't, if it's a condition. If it's positive, the form of the verb has to be in past form. Is that clear? Yes. Yes. All right, so let me... Um, let me go here. <laughs> okay, are you guys ready? Do you guys have the image? Louis, we go to room two. Okay, Jose, do you have the image? Can you hear me, Jose? Hola. Hello, Elizabeth. Estoy perdiendo un poco. Okay, Jose, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me, Jose Walter? Hi, teacher. Okay. 
And who's the one with the um, Y6 telephone? El amigo del Huawei. Ajá. Hola, responda. Hola. Okay, good. Okay, so everybody has the image. Uh, which one? Uh, the one about you have to work the the worksheet. The one that I sent you to the WhatsApp chat. La, la de, de los amigos que se fueron de compra. No, uh, another one, a new one. No, I don't have it. But do, do you no, see okay. this here? Do you see my cell phone? Um, wait. And they write a list. Yeah, it's like a list, right. The 20 sentences to change the yes. verbs in the use in the past. Exactly, past exactly. For example, Stuart lived in Vancouver. Lived. 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 Uh -huh. and yes. Lived in Vancouver. Do you have that list, uh, Elizabeth? Uh, no, 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 only, no. One, only one for Elizabeth. For example, does she exercise? Put, in this case, does, using the past. Did she exercise? Exactly. Elizabeth, can you send me a, a, a message to my WhatsApp so I can send you the, the image? I can, I'm not seeing this right now. Do you have it? I have no share. Yeah, I have it. Okay, good. All right, so start working, please. Okay. Um, I hate, I hate cooking uh, at the past. Right, you have to say it in past. I hate him. I hate cooking. I hated cooking. Uh huh. I hate. I hate cooking. cooking. Yes. Hate it. Work. I don't know how the the simple path for works. Worked. Worked. Yes. Worked. It worked. Work. Yes, worked. Worked. Mm, okay, worked. So it's Jenny worked at a hotel. At a... Yes, worked Jenny at worked a... at a hotel. At a hotel. Did, did, okay. did you swim? Uh-huh. Okay. Good. Uh, we didn't like the movie. Where did you live? Okay. Uh, they didn't drink tea. They started start. How started. Do they don't. They don't study history. We are going to take a G personal pronoun. And we are going to to convert in question. Okay. They, they don't study history. Okay. Mm -hmm. Did they study history? Uh huh. Okay. That's it. Okay. Num number ten. Do number they 10. drive? And, and negative. They don't drive. They didn't. Didn't. They. They, they didn't. didn't. They didn't no. drive. Mm -hmm. Okay. Eleven. Jenny works at a hotel. Eleven. A uh, question. The hmm. eleven ten. Sentence ten. Do they drive? And the other. Uh, did they drove? No, did they, uh, yeah, did they drove? Mm -hmm. Did they? Drove. Are you sure? 
Uh, now, when, when we make a question, we use auxiliary did if it's an action. And what happens to the main verb? Ah, you're right. It's It remains the in same. The present. Exactly. It remains the same. It stays in present. It stays in base form. Yeah. yeah so what would right. be the correct form? Right. Did they drive? Did they drive? Did they drive? Very good. Nice. Okay. Okay, the 11 and Jenny works at a hotel. At a hotel. Yeah. It's the uh, the verb just changed to the past form. Jenny work at did, did he eat breakfast? Así. Eso no es tan como un poquito más fácil. Yeah, I think. Ah, uh, didn't run fast. La última vez ella ella. Yeah, the la the the next is. Ahí lo ahí el. He has a car. Cómo está redactada la pregunta. Recuerden que se empieza con un do. Significa que es una pregunta cerrada y si empieza con un WH es abierta. Va a depender. Okay, Roxana. Hacer. Hi. All right. Which one are you doing? What number are you doing right now? Um, we are talking about the 11. 18. Uh -huh. oh, okay. No, oh, Pregunte o al revés. No, 19. He has yeah, a car. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, um, we are not sure about the past tense of has. Okay. No, no, what do you think it is? A, it's a, I think it's a, uh, had, he had a car. Yes, he had a car. But is the yeah. past, the simple past? Has, yeah. has is for the third person singular in present. Yeah. Simple present. Yeah. But in the past? Had. Had. Is changed the S by V. He had a car. He had a car, exactly. He had a, he had a car. Uh, I see. Yes. And the next is, uh, do you enjoy a sport? Yeah. Did you enjoy the sports? The start class at 8 o'clock. We are we are going to convert in negative. Mm, yeah. Didn't they start class at eight o'clock? No. Uh, maybe the class no. didn't start at. Hello, Saida. Hi, teacher. Who's your partner? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I just put but Louis I... to work with you, but I don't know where he's at. I don't know, but I did the exercise. Okay. Let, let me see if I can put you with someone else. Give me a second. Okay, teacher. Uh, yeah, it's only you right here, room three. Yes, Can you hear me, Jesse? Yes. Okay, who's your partner, Jesse? Eh, I am alone. <laughs> okay, <laughs> when, when, when that happens, always call me. You can send me a text message uh -huh. or, or, or use the WhatsApp here and say, look, I'm alone and I can transfer you to another, another group. Okay. Okay, let me see if I can move you somewhere else. Uh, uh -huh. 
Yes, see, I'm going to send you to room two. Joanna and Margarita, did you finish? Yes. Okay. So let me bring everybody else back to the main session. Are you recording the conversation? Uh, yes, the, the conversation is a good thing that you asked me that. Um, if for whatever reason you are absent in a class, in the email that Inglés Corporativo sent you, there is, a, there is a link that takes you to YouTube. You click on that link and it will take you to the classes that we, that we have every day. That's great. Yes, yes. Oh, thank you, teacher. Thank you. Thank you yes. for the information. Yes, I forgot to tell you that yesterday. So let's say that you have to be absent one day for whatever reason. Just go to, to, to that link that it takes you to YouTube and it will take you to the class that you're looking for. Yes, Antonio, okay. you have a question. Uh, yes, uh, I would like to know if these uh, sessions are all mandatory to complete uh, the course or, uh, well, or if the, you have like the a, classes, no flexibility. The yeah? classes yeah, tell me. are from Monday through Thursday. Uh, yeah. We expect you to be part of this live session and also okay. we expect you to do all the work in the platform. However, what really counts is um, not what really counts because everything counts, but what the priority yeah. is, is the work that you platform. do on the platform. Okay, but uh, if for some reason uh, some of us are absent for like, I don't know, maybe two or three sessions throughout the whole course, uh, we're not uh, at risk to like uh, lose or or be like oh. uh, I don't know. No. Um, some, oh, okay. No, just make sure that all the work that you are required to do in the platform, it's there. It's done. Okay. Yes. It's, yeah. Just just to like get the job done, get the 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 task and the homework done in the platform. Exactly. Right? Exactly in the platform. Okay. So the platform, the, the platform has to be like uh, your priority, like the platform has to be taken care of. Uh, what is the uh, expected pace to uh, complete the course? Because um, I, 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 I've been there already. Uh -huh. And the first section is, well, it has like uh, 12 uh, points, doesn't it? Uh, it has 16, 16 sessions. 16 sessions yes yeah. sir but just the first section or the whole uh, no, uh, uh, what I recommend everybody's free to work um, any way you want at a certain speed at a certain uh, um, velocity if you want to say it like that but what yeah. I do recommend is that you do the platform on a weekly basis so let's say we finish on a Thursday night make sure that by Sunday night, everything is covered in the platform. Okay, but, but uh, that, that, that's exactly the, the reason why, why I'm asking this is because uh, there are only four sections for right. this right. particular course. I, I don't exactly. know if, if it is not complete uh, no, so it, far, but- It, it is, it is. Uh, there, there, there's just four sessions. Uh, how how much or how many of the tasks that are in in each section we are like expected to complete in how much time? Okay, like I said, um, when we finish the whole course, that means four weeks from now. What we do, what 
Inglés Corporativo does, they check and they make sure that you, home, you have completed at least 80% of all the work. So at the end, 80 is the number that we want to see under your name. Then once you get your 80, you're good to go to the next level. Okay, so basically each section in the platform uh, equals to one week for saying something. Right, yes. In some okay. other levels, you have five levels. In some okay. cases, you only have four, four, un four units. So sometimes yeah. you have four, sometimes you have five. At the end, what we look for is that every person in the platform has uh, the 80% of the work done. The chart. Okay, got yes. it. Thank you very much. Sure, no problem. Yes, Roxanne. Um, what do you think? Do you think that if we finish that platform at task or the level, we can get a job? Uh, or well, so far of this? Okay, remember that everybody has a different level of the language in this level. Some of you guys are very fluent easy to understand. Some of you guys need to try a little bit harder, uh, but everybody's different. And it also depends where you want to work, Roxanne. What? I want to work practicing that. What's that? Uh, I understand that I need to study hard. Uh -huh. So, um, I don't know. I want to get more fluency and more grammar with this course, but I'm not sure. Okay. L like I said, everybody's different. Everybody has a different level. So it's kind of difficult for me to say, like, you will get a job, you will not get a job. First, because I'm not the person who's going to interview you. And second, because, you know, like everybody will apply at different places. So it's kind of difficult for me to say, yes, you will get a job, or I cannot say either, look, you need to try harder because everybody's different here. Okay, I'm not, I understand. Thank you. Yes, sir. all right, good. Anybody else has any other questions? I have one. Yes, sir. Benjamin. Yeah, how uh, one question? Can you repeat and and tell me what is located the link, the last uh, the last lesson? Because I you I were absent. It. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to upload yesterday's class tomorrow morning. So tomorrow morning before twelve noon, the class is going to be uploaded. So, uh, Inglés Corporativo sent you a, 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 an email with different links. Look for the one that it says WhatsApp link. I mean, uh, YouTube link. You click there, and after 12 noon tomorrow, it's going to be there. Okay, I got it. Yes. I did I did the lesson, uh, the page. Okay, good, good. All right. Um, so okay. we're going to stop here. Uh, we continue tomorrow. If you have questions, you can send me a WhatsApp. And if not, you just write it down and you ask me tomorrow. Thank you very much for your time. I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Same place, same time. Okay. Thank you. Good, good night. night. All right. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you later. Good night, everybody. Good night.